session we are going to see radial circuit in this radial circuit how is it, how is it working how is it going to connection these are the things we are going to see in this session first thing whatever you got in consumer and whatever you got in here we take for consumer unit then here to here one socket in here to another one socket in here to another one socket here how much socket you wanted that much i you going to contain here this is for single line to how how is this connection will be made then how is it inside of the control inside of wiring is made now see here this one is neutral at on line let's see i in this you know came from here okay now first thing neutral always not having any switching circuit so neutral come like this Okay for neutral. Everything also like that only. This is for incoming neutral, incoming air, and incoming line supply. In here too, we made some. MCCD breaker on here. Here to on face. Then come like this. This is socket one, socket two, socket three. This is for three. This is for MCB. This is for incoming T in three terminals or incoming neutral and here. and line then here to going for like this this is for radial connections uh, in special cases we are using for rcd rcd means receivable current device what is working this one is parallelly connect to in here rcd in 20 ampere 20 ampere whatever you need this having a another two terminal that's having neutral and air these two terminal will be connect to this main supply main neutral net what is this what's going on what to this this one is compare the air and neutral difference ampere rating if in case abnormal ampere rating will occur in here this will send us send the message to mcb to trip mcb will trip the circuit and going to rectify the fault otherwise this one is going to trip this other thing will do for radial circuit Thank you guys